Hello, my name is Curly711, and this game is Fez, which I've been wanting to play for a pretty long time. It you, it came out on the Xbox Live uh, for about a year, and then finally it's come to PC. Now, I've had this in my library for a little while, and I wanted to record it so it would be nice and special and I could share it with everyone. So let's start a new game. This is, as far as I know, I've only seen a little bit of gameplay, but it's a uh, puzzle platformer, and you play as this guy. Now it's very 8-bit, reminds me a lot of uh, a lot of the old school retro games, but I hear that this has a lot of new twists on it to really make the puzzle platformer more unique and modernized. So I'm pretty excited to play it. Now I've seen about uh, the first level or so, but after that it's completely new to all of us. Okay, arrow keys to move, spacebar to jump, left control to read the menu. I don't like that. Maybe I can do like X and C. Dear Gomez, please meet me at the top of village. At top of village? I have something very important to tell you. Today is special day. Geezer. Am I supposed to read this in like Asian accent or something? Hmm. Today is special day. Yes, Geezer. Woo! What? Use LJK to look around. Oh, well. Oh. I J K L to look around and left shift to talk to villagers. Taking my hands off the arrow keys to go to I J K L to look around is kind of weird. I can see this would be better in like a gamepad or something. Maybe WASD to move around. I'll mess with settings after I pass this level. Gomez. Gomez. Hey, Gomez. Oh boy. Gomez. No, I don't want to talk to you. <laughs> Gomez, Gomez! Hi. Yeah, I could run around all day too. <laughs> this is kind of like their program setting is just running around all day. I like how I'm super fast. Or faster than them. Also, my breakdance skills. Oh. Hold up in the air to grab like. Oh, yeah. Oh, jump up, jump up. Oh, I kind of... Okay, jump. But I'm kind of holding it for so long that it just takes me up. And if I hold down, then press space, I kind of... And space. What's my favorite shape? Triangle. <laughs> Not a cube. How do you even know what a cube is? You live in a two-dimensional world. <laughs> exactly. Let's go in this door. Because it's the first door we come by. And they told us to. Hmm. Quite a tiny room we have here. Oh yeah. Looks like we've got a chair, a clock, a mantle, and a dapper looking fella right here. Can we go in this? Can we crawl through the fireplace? That's something we could do in Cave Story. Hmm. Alright. Let's climb this ladder. That looks like a geezer, but is it the geezer? Oh, what, what is it? 
Locked doors require keys. Just press up to climb vines. Yes, but I'm gonna talk to this lass. I love village. I lived here my whole life. Me too. I love village too. Can I climb this? I cannot. Oh, yeah. Hey, geezer. Reality is perception. Perception is subjective. Fascinating. I guess you're not the geezer I, I, I'm looking for. Can I open the mailbox? Can I go in this door? Yes! Arr, it's pirate. Mm -hmm. Now this doesn't look like a painting. This looks like a window. A window through his house. Mm -hmm. In his bed that I'm walking all over. Mm -hmm. Get my dirty feet all over this. Wow. Mm -hmm. All right, pirate guy. Nice house. Mm -hmm. And it's daytime. Mm -hmm. Or was that a portrait of his own house? Okay, that's some interesting clipping right there. It just kind of clipped through the whole tree. So I'm behind it, and there I'm kind of in it. I'm in front of the trunk, but not of the branch. Very interesting. All right, let's keep going up. Meow. Do you talk? No. Hey, there's Mr. Dapper up there. I'll go talk to him in a minute. Hey, Sally Sue, how are you? I'm teaching geometry, I see. How about we have some extra lessons? Oh yeah. There are no such things as devil squares. Interesting. Are you a teacher or are you like a, a priestess? Only regular squares. There's only one such thing as square. Mm -hmm. There's there's only the one true square and no other square. I'll leave you to your theology. Mm -hmm. What? Oh, I can't reach it. Mm -hmm. I gotta jump over here. Mm -hmm. Jump over here. Oi. Mm, one more door before I talk to Mr. Dapper over there. Hmm, kitchen. I am kind of thirsty. <coughs> yeah, I can't do that sound effect because I'm actually thirsty. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm just hanging out mm -hmm. up here. Oh, I can stand on the line. Mm -hmm. I'm just kind of derping around, getting used to the controls. We can look around. Oh, geezer's up there. But the view doesn't stay centered on me. You are looking nice and flat today. Oh, thank you. I, I guess being flat is acceptable in this society. And that is all you have to mm. say. Good day, sir. Good mm. day. Mm. Hey, Giza. Ha, there you are. Today is special day. Yes, yes, I heard that in the letter. Adventure is ready. It's Gomez time. It's Gomez time. Okay. Da da da. Any time now. Just you wait. There you go. It's a hexagon. It's a hexagon of power. Oh my god. Oh my god. Hexagon. Hexagon. It's like he's never seen hexagon before. It's... It's getting wibbly wobbly. Oh my god. It's a little loud. That is no hexagon. Eep, beep, 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 beep. Yes, indeed. You are a cube. Or what I think is a cube. If I had ever seen a cube before in my life. Hmm, yes. Mm hmm. Quite. I can't understand anything, and it's kind of scary in my room listening to this creepy, creepy man music. 
but uh yes are you are you sending me on an adventure you're sending me on a mission i'm assuming terrifying mission dealing with space and the dimension that i don't know about good thing since i'm two-dimensional i'll be nearly invisible in three dimensions oh we're going all ufo the stars the stars are cubes too oh hyperdrive oh Thanks for not abducting me and just just put me down. Put me down, please. Oh my. Yes. Okay, okay. Ah, back to solid ground. Oh my goodness, is that... It is... It is... A fez. I don't know what I expected. But I'm satisfied. This is exactly what it should be. It should give you a damn fez. Of power! Da 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 Use AD to change. Okay, this is making sense. That's why they didn't use WASD for the looking around, because AD moves my perspective. Oh! Don't forget which dimension is the true dimension. Whoa! The cubes, the artifacts. This is not the video this is the game this is the game the game crashed the game is booting up man i got so much rain oh yeah oh my it's kind of glitchy womp indeed this is inception man Right, now the menu? No. And wake up. But I'm wearing a hat. Things are different. I can feel it in my bones, in my insides, and in my outsides. I have something powerful. Let's use A and D to look around my room before we go outside. Womp. Oh my god, Banzai! Oh. That side of my room's kinda sad. Peeling wallpaper. Come on, Fizz. Womp. Oh yeah. Got a nice uh, rectangular cobweb up in the corner. And apparently I can play the drums. Can I play them here? Nope. I can't jump on them. Oh, whoa, level one just got a whole new meaning. Hmm, wow. But I think I'm gonna have to cut it off. Oh, not quite yet. Gomez, something went wrong. I need your help. I was sent to guide you. I am Dot. The hexadron. Oh, hexahedron has been fragmented. Oh my. It looked like a cube to me. Shattered and scattered all over the world. You must restore it. Alright, Dot. Alright, I got it. I can do this. I'm the chosen one. Without it, everything will collapse. You have received a gift. A great secret has been revealed to you. There is a world beyond your village. I'd be concerned if there wasn't. I mean, you can't really procreate with only, like, three girls and a young child. 
and dimensions beyond the ones you occupy. This door leads to the outside world, but for now it is but for now it's sealed shut. The marking on it indicates that it won't open until you have collected at least one cube. There are many such doors in the world, each requiring more cubes than the last. To reach the end of this journey, you will need to find all 32 cubes. But first, you must leave this place. There are eight cube bits in this village, like this one right here. Like eight, good number. Together, they'll form a full cube, which you can use to unseal the door. Find them. So, quick recap. <laughs> Shiny and golden cubes, very important. Gotta find them all. Gotta catch them all, you mean? Or else the universe collapses with you in it. Oh, that that's kind of serious. Yeah, maybe I'll do that to save my village or whatever. No pressure. Ha, 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 ha. And remember, use DA to change your perspective. Now get going. Alright, and I will get going. But as the sun sets here, so does the sunset in the real world. And I need to go. I will record some more and upload it at a later date. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Gully711. Bye.